Hey there, my name is Chris Jube with Monument Glamping. Go ahead and book your experience or subscribe to our website at monumentglamping.com. Question, what is glamping? Uh, glamping is kind of a recent word in the dictionary. The Oxford Dictionary just got it in there in 2016, so it's relatively new. But let me go into the similarities and differences between camping and glamping because they are different but they're also the same. First of all, there's tents. You go you go camping in tents, right? Or maybe an RV or a trailer or something like that. You're on vacation. Glampers are on vacation just like campers are. And then there's the outdoors. There's beautiful outdoors. I've got birds flying around me and stuff. It's, it's a gorgeous day today here in Monument, Colorado. So there's tents, There's a, you are on vacation, and you are in the outdoors. Those are the similarities, but that's about where the similarities end. I married a woman who loves to camp, and I am what you would call indoorsy. Glamping is glamorous camping. Everything's set up for you. This, this, is, this is what you get when you arrive. You just bring your food and your adult beverages. We even provide that for an extra feast. And we as hosts actually enjoy doing that for you. We want to give you the best experience that we can possibly give you. Now the second difference is not as noticeable, and we didn't notice it until people actually started coming to visit our property. They don't stick around. They, they actually are tourists. They're visiting the Colorado Springs area Area and the Denver area and the mountain the mountain range of Colorado they're going to re area restaurants they're taking they're going on hiking trails and things like that they're here for a glamorous experience in the morning when the Sun Sun rises right here and in the evening when things start cooling off then they like to sit around their propane fire pit it's really it's really glamorous <laughs> now compare that to a campground a campground has people on site they have water parks and horseshoe things and 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 stuff to do on camp you can love horseshoes all your life and we have some of that we've got some we got a cool creek that people can walk we got some mode trails and stuff but for the most part people are going off campus for their touristy activities the third difference it has to do with the type of property you're staying on now with my glamping operation you are actually staying on our private property that's a key difference between glamping and camping a lot of glampers out there are people like me landowners that have beautiful property that want to open it up to others to to enjoy so you aren't really a customer coming to my property welcome to marathon may i help you you are a guest coming onto our property so those are the differences between camping and glamping and i hope you enjoyed this video if you if you liked it go ahead and press like and subscribe to my channel and we'll keep in touch